Kapil Sibyl has spoken to headlines today. Let's listen in. We are joined by the Law Minister Kapil Sibal. Let's take his reaction. Poll dates have been announced finally, nine phases. Uh, the duration is uh, relatively shorter. Do you think it is better? No, better or, or worse is something for the Election Commission to decide. The whatever the Election Commission whatever the election commission decides is acceptable to us. Okay. Uh, your election is uh, considerably more tougher this time. Is that with, your opinion or with, are you giving with, somebody else's opinion? With the backdrop of past five years, the Anna agitation, the AAP party no, 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 and then it, Ashutosh is your, going... Is it the channel's opinion or are you asking It is a general opinion that people are... No, I'm asking, since you say it's your election particularly, is it your opinion, channel's opinion? Who have you talked to? Uh, if you ask to my constituents, they say there is no such problem. You are saying so. Are you playing for somebody or no, you are... Why I am saying is that uh, all the BJP or the AAP have been uh, putting the strongest candidates in no, your constituency. There is no BJP candidate. Why are you saying that again? You are fa factually no, wrong. Ap, ap, you know, one, one second. You just said that BJP and AAP are putting the strongest candidates. There is no BJP candidate. So how can you make BJP that statement? He is likely to put a strong ah, candidate so since you are a... So now you have modified the statement. But, but so the AAP party know. has put a strong candidate. I don't know whether you, everybody is strong. If you were a candidate for AAP, you would also be strong. For us, everybody is a strong candidate. We are here to fight. We are here to fight an election, and we are here to win the election, right? And we will demonstrate that on May 16th when the results of Chandni Chowk come. Oh, election Commission has also said, sir, that opinion polls and exit polls, a call had to be taken by the uh, government because we had said in 2004 that they should be banned. Again, they put the ball in your court. No, no, it's not for us to decide. Point is, Election Commission, I believe, has the power under 324 themselves if they feel that opinion polls of this nature, especially in the context of the string operation that took place, which your channel, uh, in fact, uh, uh, re revealed, um, uh, it's for the Commission to decide. They have sought our opinion again, but as far as we are concerned, we are a little hesitant for the reason that we require the... The, 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 the unanimous uh, support of all the political parties and in the present context that's not going to happen and if we take a decision unilaterally then you are the ones who are going to say that we are, are you know interfering with freedom of expression so we don't want any of those issues to to unnecessarily come up I think by, by and large now people realize that a lot of these opinion polls right are, 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 are going the way uh, you know of the khulasa that uh, that, 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 that you, you were able to show to the public right. so People are not entirely believing uh, these opinion polls and I ultimately leave it to the good sense of the people. But I do believe if the Election Commission thinks that this is something that needs to be dealt with, then I think the Election Commission under 324 can pass an order. Do you think uh, regarding your constituency, you've modified your campaign with a lot of youth voters coming in? Uh, do, have you gone through the uh, social media way uh, yeah. trying to get in touch with See, as far as I am concerned, I've been here for five years. Right? I have visited the constituency about 575 times. Uh, most of the work that I promised I have done, right, by and large. And I have been with the people and people know my work. I have not made any false promises. And I've been there for the last five years. Uh, recent entrants have been there only for the last, one of them has been there for the last few weeks. And the other one has not yet arrived. So obviously, um, you know, so you're all set. No, I am always set. You're always I'm set. always set. Now, last question: uh, Considering the image of your party, the allegations of corruption flying all from all corners, do you think this is the most tough election that the Congress Party is facing well, this time? I don't know time? what allegations of corruption you're talking about, because if you look at corrupt people in this country, you will find most of them in Andhra Pradesh and belonging to the BJP. Seven of their ministers are in jail. One Yedu Rappa, who they have embraced again, who okay. epitomized corruption. Right, and there are proceedings against him. In, in Gujarat, uh, one corrupt minister who has been convicted continues to be in the cabinet. Right, in, there's a lady called Nani who was convicted for murder. Right, has been given death sentence. Was part of the ministry of Gujarat. There's another minister against whom there are charges. In Madhya Pradesh, Sh Chauhan's family has got any number of plots. So, if you really want to talk about corruption, though your media never talks about the corruption within the BJP, but the fact of the matter is, name me one Congress minister so in the me, once me. one second. Name me one Congress minister who has been charged for corruption in the last ten years in the central government. He's been tried, but no, you no, have no, no, no. One Congress. No, nobody's been tried. There have been allegations. Uh, what does allegations mean? I can make allegations against you 
they name me one Congress minister who has been tried or charged for corruption in the last 10 years in UPA 1 and UPA 2 and you will not be able to name a single whereas their people can be named and they are in jail so let's not talk about corruption of the Congress party the boot is on the other leg Thank you for talking to us. That was Kapil Sibal actually geared up for the upcoming elections and he says that his party would deliver to the people. With camera person Rajiv, this is Mosmi Singh in Delhi for Headlines Today.